This is Bumper to Bumper TV. This is what usually gets attention at the Chicago Auto Show. High performance cars with flashy styling. This year, there was a different offering in the Technology Garage area, which we got into before the show opened. Technology used to mean traditional stuff like USB ports, display screens, Bluetooth access, and even electric vehicles. And then there was this. Yes, it looks like a rudimentary box on wheels because that's just what it is. Meet the ladies of Sonic Doom, Chicago area teenagers who literally flipped the script and made a household appliance roll. They got a refrigerator from our recycled refrigerator program. Um, they got blueprints and they got boxes with tools and um, pieces and parts of a chassis, a steering wheel. This is part of a program by Illinois-based ComEd to encourage girls to consider career options using science, technology, and math skills. STEM for short. We got a bunch of parts and they gave us very vague instructions and we were set to work. We had just step by step, again, extremely vague instructions. And yeah, each week we had a different set of parts, instructions that they gave us. Under the guidance of a mentor, 60 girls from area schools competed building a workable vehicle over a six-week period. A race-off produced the winners, who proudly showed off their handiwork at this year's auto show. So this wasn't really about the race as much as we were trying to promote STEM for girls because it's only 23% of STEM jobs are held by women. So the main part of this was the symbolism trying to get kids into these races, like looking at this and feeling, oh, that's cool. Why don't I try and experiment with this? The finished product is not aerodynamic, despite a trailing wing. But the electric motor, transmission, chassis systems do work, and the top speed is a blazing 15 miles per hour. These girls are remarkable. They're interested in science, technology, engineering, math, um, and they've got they've got big hopes and dreams for the future. And it's it's impressive. It's just exciting to see. They they know so much, and they're so excited about everything. Now, drag racers may not have much to worry about the competition from these ladies for a while. But if the auto industry is smart, it will be worth keeping an eye out for talent like this now to become the next generation of designers and engineers. This is Greg Morrison. We want to know what you think, so email us. The address is bumper to bumper tv at cs.com.